welcome back to Below Debbie and this is day 21 of my typing.com 30 day challenge. Um, we're back here to finish off our MLA citations and possibly go into common medical terms. Um, I'm hoping my, my average speed will go up a little bit more than that. I mean, it's still improved. But I was hoping to, you know, get some, get some more. <laughs> In addition to the in-text citations, you'll need a bibliography or a works cited page at the end of your paper or project. You might be wondering if there's a difference between a bibliography and a works cited. They're similar, but not the same. Type on to learn more. A bibliography. Ah, oh man, I was trying to get my finger pinky to go up there and it did not go. Uh. Oh boy. Is she back? What are you doing? Kitty is um. It's silly, I guess. <gasps> Yay! Okay, kitty, kitty is not being crazy kitty right now, so that's good. Let's practice how to format full citations for a bibliography or works cited page. Oh, oh no. Oh, I've got the comma. I guess, you know, it's still just I've never really been a writer. Yes, you know, uh, I don't know. When I was a kid, uh, you know, kids weren't ever supposed to have ideas, or thoughts, they were just supposed to do. They were told and it was broken. At least, you know, my mom wasn't like that. It was it was my dad. And all that. Children. Anybody else, I guess, for that matter. Um, but I guess I just never developed that skill to organize my thoughts and stuff because I was never allowed to have them. <laughs> well, see, I just, I don't know. 
the, those work sided stuff I don't expect to do very well on because it doesn't it doesn't have to flow. When citing a chapter in a book or anthology, put the title of the chapter section in quotation marks before the title of the whole book. If there is an editor, put their names after the title of the book. The section's page number goes at the end of the citation. And having like every <laughs> every word be capitalized. So. Ah. You know, I mean, you don't think how your thoughts and actions will affect the future <laughs> of your kids, I guess. But you know, constantly squelching kids is never a good idea, I reckon. Rabbit psychology. How are kids supposed to develop these amazing minds of theirs if they're never taught to use them? Nine. Yeah, it's hard to get those fingers to want to go up there to the, uh, the number row. Because uh, I'm just so used to hunting and checking on that row. <laughs> so it's hard to make the fingers go up there because they don't usually do that. Uh, they usually... Oh. Come, become completely detached from the keyboard and just start hunting and pecking on that top row. So, okay, when citing an article in a scholarly journal, follow the same rules as a chapter in a book, but also make sure to include information about the volume, issue, and specific publication date. I mean, yeah. uh, I guess I'm little bias on it having been on the other side of that oh I hate the I meant that two nine I did it. I did the thing with my fingers. Top row. Oh, 
That's crazy. Uh, I did the numbers. It was bad, but I still did it. <laughs> uh -oh. Keep using... I thought I did the C. Okay, I guess the uh, didn't understand that one. Oh, ah. I just don't, I don't feel the, uh, don't feel the flow in this. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, like, uh, this one. Okay. Like sometimes my fingers just know where to go, and then other times I'm like, what? What is going on? Because they don't seem to remember at all. Oh, I did. Oh no. Oh. I did. See, that to me is very um, hard to determine that there's a space at the end of that since it's a obviously a link a website. And that should not have a space in there, in the website address. So, <laughs> to me, that is wrong. You know, I have to put a space, even though there's not one there. Oh yeah, that was, that was terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. When citing social media, you can use the author's real name or his or her handle or username. Make sure to include the date and time, if available. Oh, symbol. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I did the G, I think. Oh, the when I try to put my finger up that far, my other fingers go down. So no. One, two, four, nine, seven, four, nine, four, four, 
eight, six, four, eight, two, eight, eight, eight. So the numbers are definitely a lot harder to to get the fingers to go up there and stay in place at the same time. Uh oh. Um, boom. Girls are four. I'm doing it. It's like, what the heck? Equals. And period. Oh. We're almost done with the section. I think this is the last one. I did the apostrophe that I missed a comma. The numbers are tough. Okay, we got our 15 minutes in today. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.